Hey, this is Nikki, and I'm here to share messages that I get from spirit for all of us who are all on this journey to love and to reunite with our divine vibrational matches in this lifetime. And today I'm just going to share a message about saying just, I've got my night sweatshirt on, so it's just say, just get on and do it. So I had a couple of messages um, and I'm going to share a channeling that I did from, I shared um, from her twin to her um, last week. And then she also asked me to share, to channel a letter from her to higher self to her twin. And the reason why I'm going to use this today is, or why I'm guided to use it today, is because um, is because there are those, um, this particular lady and her twin uh, have been, uh, got married, divorced and remarried and have had two kids together. And uh, it is just a sign of just, so it's just a message of saying, you, you know, don't give up hope. Just keep putting foot, keep putting one foot in front of the other every single day, and just know that all of the pain, all of the hurt, all of the, you know, everything that goes on with these connections and in your life, is there as a mirror for you to learn and grow, learn and grow, learn and grow, and that's and that's uh, having the power to look objectively from a higher perspective at your life and what's going on and what happens. Um, you know, when you're in the middle of it, of course, that is, that is you know, really difficult to, to do. But again, it's comfort to know that this too shall pass, right? Because just overnight, I had a couple of emails from different people just saying, I can't go on anymore. Uh, my twins told me this, or I found out that they've got engaged, or I found out that they said that they don't want a future with me, or, you know. And uh, these things, when these things happen, it is just, it's heartbreaking. But the thing is, is it's happening for you to grow. And through those really dark times, we do our biggest growth. And uh, so that's what the message is about today, because <clears throat> this letter um, is so beautiful because they have obviously, you know, been married, separated, remarried, two kids. And, you know, you can only imagine all of the uh, emotions that have gone th gone through that whole process for them over the last, I think it's about 30 years, I think. So I'm going to share the letter and also I'm going to share uh, energy for today. Just I've just been shuffling them to say, OK, what is the energy for today that we need to know about? And it is, look at that, the Ace of Cups. So it is a gift, right? This is a gift of emotion, basically. These connections, this is a gift of emotions for you to... You know, it may be to overflow with emotion, as in you need to get rid of stuck emotions. Um, because unless we release and let go, and just as I say that, it literally is raining <laughs> really hard here. So it is, you know, this release of emotions in whatever way. You know, this is, all emotions are good, right? I think there is this um, kind of... Um, school of thought that we have to be happy all the time well that's just not right is it because we are human and we have all sorts of different emotions and we go through all sorts of different ups and downs and sadness and you know the whole gambit of life and um, without all of that then we wouldn't appreciate when we've come through really difficult times and this is what this is saying it's a gift you know even though it may not feel like it and you're like, oh, thanks, but I think I can do without this gift. <laughs> it's just to know that when you reach the other side, you'll be able to look back and just go, okay, I know why that had to happen. I know because I feel different now, you know. But the important thing, look at this. Look at what's at the bottom of the deck. It's the three of ones. This is, look, is that spiritual. This is somebody going out on a spiritual path the seeker you know 
the seeker actually for the fourth wand and the fourth wand is the spiritual marriage is is the four of wands is 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 you know is sacred marriage so this is why this this happens so wherever you are at the moment if you are in that kind of like when you feel like i just can't go on anymore then just remember that feeling that has brought you to your knees has been this the divine wrapping a gift up in a very challenging wrapping paper but once you uncover that and release all the energies and everything that brings up for you underneath as long as you don't close off your heart then you know you'll be freer you'll be different you will have grown through the experience so because you will be led to go on this spiritual journey so with that i'm going to share the chat the channeling that i did for the ladies so this is from the lady's higher self to her twin so um so here we go so you have gone from being my knight in the light to the king of my heart you have guided me to become the truth that lies in my heart you have been my key the one true soul that has turned my life around with each turn of the handle we have grown we have let go we have shed tears of pain we have cried tears of joy all of that release and light happen because of our pathway together i am beyond the rainbow grateful that we found each other that we are fulfilling our sacred mission we did it can you believe it we finally did it and are still doing it every day we walk this beautiful physical plane together you are my king, my light, my switch to remembering all of me, which shines through you. Okay, so I absolutely, now I'm reading this again, just in the context of what's happened overnight and the emails that I got this morning. And then, you know, just the message that, and I cannot tell you, but you could have tell by the light just then on my face, because just as I was reading that, the rain has stopped, there's a break in the clouds and the sun has just started to beam down. So it is, you know, and these sorts of things, I know that it's difficult. I know that it's really, it's horrible when you hear something about your twin or they said to you that that's it, I don't want to be with you or I'm marrying someone else or I'm having a kid with someone else or, you know, it could be anything, right? There's just so many, so many awful things that, you know, get chucked our way with these connections, with these divine paths. And uh, all of it is, is just so you can grow, just like this letter says, you know. And that can be super challenging because sometimes you just think, but, but actually all I want is an easy life. <laughs> so, but the thing is, is that you didn't sign up for an easy life. You know, if you signed up for an easy life, then you wouldn't be on this path because that isn't your journey this time. Because here you came to be a spiritual warrior, to be a warrior of the light. And to do that means that you have to go through dark energies in order to transmute those energies. That's just the way it is. So um, that means you just got to buckle up and, and, you know, understand that it's a process that we're all in. And it's about how we manage to balance our energies as we're going through that process. So, um her higher self again i love this so and just again the sun is just like beaming down <laughs> so you have gone from being my knight in the light to the king of my heart you have guided me to become the truth that lies in my heart you have been my key the one true soul that has turned my life around with each turn of the handle we have grown we have let go we have shed tears of pain we have cried tears of joy all of that release and light happened because of our pathway together. I am beyond the rainbow grateful that we found each other, that we are fulfilling our sacred mission. We did it. Can you believe it? We finally did it and are still doing it every day we walk this beautiful physical plane together. You are my king, my light, my switch to remembering all of me, which signs through you oh oh it's so amazing and um 
there is that, you know, we all shine through the light, through the reflection of each other, you know, and uh, that's why it's so important to share on this, you know, because it all, it is difficult, you know, and there are things that come up and sometimes you do feel like, oh, I just can't go on, you know, can't I just, you know, have like a normal existence, well, there is no, no such thing as normal, but, um, you know, but then that's the point. You came here to be a light, uh, a light warrior. And with that, you've been switched on. And once you've been switched on, you know, it changes things. So let's have a go. We're going for the Messages of Love Oracle. So today the energy was the Ace of Cups and the Three of Wands. So going on basically you know, going on an emotional, spiritual journey for today. And the method, look at that, release. And look at that, retreat. <laughs> so today is all about going on your own spiritual path. You know, it's only in your own balance, and your own light, focusing on a passion, setting yourself a goal, you know, um, that allows you to move out of you know that pain energy look at that was just popped up it's this you know so those things are like you know the more that you focus on on you like setting yourself a goal and getting passionate about that goal whatever it is anything that takes your mind off just all of the you know all of this basically um and anything that that you set your mind to that basically is about doing something for you, you know, doing something that will make you feel good about yourself, whatever that is, you know, at whatever it is. Um, I've set my to, like in August, I'm going to do the Three Peaks Challenge, which is climbing the three highest mountains in the UK. Uh, and you've got to do it in like a crazy 24 hours or under 24 hours or something. So, um, yeah, that's a goal that I've wanted to do for a long time. And then, yeah, I'm going to do it. So these are the things. Just do something <laughs> that takes your mind off of all of the other stuff. And where you can channel your energy into something positive for you. And that three of ones, right? The three of ones, that is the three of ones. You know, channeling your energy into your spiritual path and wherever that takes you. So I'm just going to do one more little uh, what message they want to give. Look at that strength. You're strong. You came here as a light warrior. You are strong. You have more strength than you can even imagine. So just keep on going. All right. I'm going to leave it by reading the letter one more time. Just one more time because I love it. Okay, so we go. You have gone from being my knight in the light to the king of my heart. You have guided me to, some, to become the truth that lies in my heart. You have been my key, the one true soul that has turned my life around. With each turn of the handle, we have grown. We have let go. We have shed tears of pain. We have cried tears of joy. All of that release and light happened because of our pathway together. I am beyond the rainbow grateful that we found each other that we are fulfilling our sacred mission. We did it. Can you believe it? We finally did it. And we are still doing it every day we walk this beautiful physical plane together. You are my king, my light, my switch to remembering all of me, which shines through you. So there you go. What an amazing message. I love it. And um, I just want to say again, thank you so much to everyone that shares their stories and their letters and like comes to me. And, you know, because it's all through each of us, you know, we mirror so much. We're basically just one massive mirror reflecting everything back of what we need to heal, what we need to do, what we need to let go of, what we need to grow through. And uh, that's a collective journey. You're not on your own. So, you know, if you're feeling on your own, you're feeling a little bit, oh, I just don't know what to do. Um, set yourself a goal. Could be anything. 
just something for you and then every single day put a step forwards towards it all right well listen i really hope that helped if you would like to have a healing a reading a channeling or to get any of my books all details are in the description box against this video uh, but in the meantime i really hope um, that you have a good day and stay well stay bright and stay switched on to the light see ya bye